Yeah man, what well, go on? Welcome forward to the channel Z. And you don't know Spice can do a little surgery and thing. And we don't have to bash her now. We don't want nothing to happen to her now. For you don't know, say, I want to have a great female dancehall artist. This is it. And don't know if your life she want to do some body work and thing. We love that a fair business, but we just want the best her. You see? Yeah man, I'm going to come on to people, health and thing, you see it, I just the best we wish for them, you see it, from Sandy and Bones TV, you see it, and go, just go forward now if you don't hear him on my spice, I say, you see it. January again, so last year was a very rough year for me. Yeah, so this year, I did procedures again in January, and when I went back the following months to do my follow-up, they told me that some of my organs was failing because of the previous surgeries, because I did so many multiple surgeries. And I break the news to my friends a few days ago, and I told them. But one thing I didn't tell anyone, and I used to keep this a secret, and I'm gonna tell you tonight. I didn't know some organs I have in my body until I got sick. And they started to see something called spleen and they were telling me that my spleen is enlarged. And they were giving me other things that was happening in my body and so I didn't want to say anything. I didn't want to tell my family or friends. I didn't want to scare anyone. And so a few months I've been battling this secret on my own. And they thought I had cancer. And I didn't say anything to anyone. And so they sent me to the Cancer Institute. You left the fan jacket with the results because I wanted to break the news to you guys tonight. In a few months, I've been battling this secret. And when the doctors drew the blood, you got it, Spice. You got it. You got this. And I went for my results. Come on, Spice. Come on. You got it. Tell us. Come on. You got it, sis. I kept it a secret by myself because I didn't want to hurt anyone, but I got the results. And again, that's why this name is on the stage. Because for the first time in my life, I was crying with joy. Yeah. I'm set for free. My organs are coming back to normal. any longer I really just wanted to share my testimony and talk about God yeah. and praise Jesus yeah. and give him the thanks because he's my king my lord my savior the alpha the omega the beginning and the end oh my god he will win and he will be chastity I tell people all the time that I'm a little slack on the stage my mouth is very dirty but there is nobody like me that know my god when we put up in that fire one time we're like Jesus to give God the glory and the praise that's right, that's right. and I wanted to it's say thank else. you Jesus that last night wasn't my last night and I want to thank all of you for coming here because it's a special day for me and we're going to celebrate like I said we're going to party we're going to eat we're going to have a good time if my host can come back on the stage I don't know what's supposed to be happening next but I'd love to see the fire dancer the fire dancer is here I want to get into a nice good vibe and a good moment because we got a reason to celebrate Yandy. I'm so happy.
gives life. And I was just talking to Jasir. And he just buried two of his friends. Tomorrow is not promised to no one. But tonight, I want you to think about your life. What the enemy meant for bad, yes. God turned it around good. for good. Yeah. And I know some of us have our communion, our drinks, but I think right now we need to pray for grace. Yes. That God signs, seals, and delivers that no weapon moving forward that is formed against her shall prosper. And every tongue that rises up against her shall be cut off. Those of you who can pray in your own way, can you stretch your hands to this sister? Because half of this were thinking that you were going to say you had been struck, you, you had been stricken with cancer. That's what the enemy wants. But there is more for you to do, my sister. Eyes haven't seen, ears haven't heard, neither have it entered into the hearts of men what God has in store for you. So I say to you, some trust in horses. Some trust in chariots. But we have decided to trust in the name of the Lord. So just for 60 seconds, just open your mouth, stretch your hands this way. Father, we thank you. We pray for our sister that nothing else comes against her. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. 